The Henley Island Helpers are a volunteer organization that helped to raise funds to support rowing in Niagara. They have a special event coming up on October 1st. Tammy Lyons joins us. Tammy, this is the second time or third time for the artisan market? It is technically the third time, but it's the second one we've done in October. So the second fall artisan market. Exactly. Yeah. Tell me about how this is all coming together. Um, well, it's coming together quite nicely. Um, we have over 35 artisans that are going to be coming. Um, anywhere from um, oil painting, stained glass, woodworking, um, knitting, crocheting, pottery, quite a, quite a number of artisans. Tell me about the helpers. Uh, I, I know there's quite a number of you. You've been around Ooh. since the 1960s. What kind of activities besides this artisan market do you do? Um, well, we have a patio, which is down right beside the boat houses on Henley Island. And we, oh gosh, the Henley Island Helpers has been around, like you said, in the 60s, since 1963. And they were put together by a group of women whose husbands worked on the island and just said, hey, we need helpers. We need to raise funds um, for different things that were going on and things that they needed on the island. So these ladies came together and they worked at uh, the grandstands. There was a, a booth there, there still is, and they were selling hot dogs and hamburgers. And then they built the, um, the restaurant area that's down on Henley Island at the lower part. Um, this is separate from the alumni clubhouse. It is separate. They're up top of the island, and this one is right beside the, the row houses. It's right on the water. Um, they recently made a patio that's covered, and the artisan market actually goes around in the area that, that we have there um, is where all the artisans will set up. We're going to have a musician there. Um, uh, we have a licensed bar. We're serving breakfast and lunch. And they serve breakfast and lunch every weekend. That's something that I think a lot of people don't realize. Don't, uh, you, That's a hidden gem. It's right, a great spot. Right. It's like our best kept secret. Um, it opens at 8 o'clock in the morning and goes through till about 11, 30, 12 o'clock, depending, because we often um, take into, uh, you know, we accommodate the rowers that are coming off the water if they're doing some training and they can pop in and get something as well. Getting back to October 1st, yeah. that's going to be a busy day on the island. Uh, something else is happening it October 1st. It is too. Um, the, the alumni house up top is hosting the Cicada Festival. Um, so that's going on. And that's a concert, it's, all day long concert. It's an all day long concert, that's right. So they're going to have music there and we'll have our musician at the lower patio going on as well as there is another artisan market going on. I think they call it the Handmade Market and it will be taking place at Victorian Porch on Hartsell Road. So there's going to be two really great markets to So you might have attend. some people wanting to go to both, right, dividing right. their time in between the two things. That's right. And I've had people actually talk to me, stop me and say, hey, we're going to Cicada, but we're coming to the artisan market first. So, so that's really nice. Free admission yeah. to the artisan market? Yes, it is. Yes. Yeah. On both counts. The Victorian um, porch is also free and so is ours. Free to come down, have breakfast, have lunch. Um, grab a drink and listen to our musician and you might even be able to hear remnants of the Cicada concert starting at 1130. What so. are the funds raised used for? Oh, they are raised so much. I know you have some scholarships and bursaries for we're, high school kids. Is we're that... looking at doing that type thing. Um, I don't know if they did in the past. I don't think so. But moving forward, we'd like to do that type of thing. But the, the reason the ladies were put together was to help raise funds for the island and for rowers in general in Niagara. Has it bought equipment so, in the past? It has, the yeah. We recently helped purchase a motor for one of the boats. They've bought shells. Um, the Henley Island helpers did the put in new doors for where the boat houses are, where they store the shells. Um, so they bought shells. They bought the automatic door lifts that are there. Um, refurbished the buildings that are there as well as we put up a new fence. We did the patio. Um, a roof on one of the buildings. So they, they do quite a lot. The funds are going back into that community. So Tammy, October 1st, what time? Um, it starts at 9 and ends at 3. And don't forget, turn left after the bridge. That's right, turn left after the bridge. Yeah. Thanks for joining us today, Tammy. Thank you for having me.